Hello. Welcome to the Rockford Plantation. This is the home of my friend, Colonel Edward Hand. I served with Colonel Hand valiantly through the American Revolution. Colonel Hand was fought in the French and Indian War and was a very good fighter. He sided with the Americans during the American Revolutionary War and that's where I met him. He raised a rifle regiment and we were sent out with General Washington on his battles. We first were at the siege of Boston where we kicked the British out. We then were chased across New York shamelessly, crossed the Delaware River into Pennsylvania, but he had a plan. General Washington attacked Trenton and basically took care of this Hessian regiment that were guarding the city of Trenton and the capital of New Jersey. After we scattered them, we crossed the river, but General Washington wanted more, and he knew that Princeton offered a prize opportunity for us. Princeton was a good target for us. We crossed over, and General Washington came over to the colonel and said, I need you to hold the line. I need you to hold and fight the British in a fighting retreat, but hold back as much as you can, because that we want the British to come here at the edge of the Delaware River at night. If you come too early, we'd be trapped. If you come too late, well, they'd be camping too far up the road and might get on to ways to our plan. So General Washington gave Colonel Hand these orders. He went out and he did them perfectly. The British, he fought the British in a fighting retreat all the way down into the city of Trenton. We were, had our backs to the Delaware River when it was halted by the British and Cornwallis. We had our backs against the Delaware River as night fell. General Cornwallis, standing above us, said, ah, we'll bag the fox in the morning, meaning the Continental Army. However, General Washington had people stoke the fires, and we snuck out another route around the British and were able to go in to the city of Princeton and take it as ours. We crossed the river again, and now Washington had his two critical victories. After this battle, my friend Colonel Hand was promoted to Brigadier General of the Continental Army. He was then tasked in charge of taking care of Fort Pitt. You know where Pittsburgh is. That's where we were sent. But he had many quarrels with the Continental Congress and did not like the position. General Washington put him up north to take care of the Indian problems that we've been having. With the Indians attacking our troops, the British were incentivizing the British to attack us. Colonel Hand signed some peace treaties and took care of that part for us. We were then transferred to Yorktown to General Washington and helped him win that critical battle of Yorktown. And by then, the Revolutionary War had ended. Colonel Hand had many things to do when he came back here to the Rockford Plantation. He was a physician. He was also in Pennsylvania Congress. He is also in the Continental Congress. And he died here in the early 1800s, I'm sad to say. Still a physician and still taking care of the people. So to my friend, Colonel Edward Hand, I thank you.